Welcome back for sports. Southland Conference Media Day will kick off on Monday. Lots of changes in the Demons locker room and the sideline. Seven new coaches and 30 transfers. And of course, with former Demons quarterback Zach Clement transferring to Southeastern, the question is, will there be controversy around who will be under center? Our Mayor Margaret Ellison sat down with Coach Laird and he shared with only us who won the starting job. You know, after going through spring, um, you know, you know, bringing in Tyler, um, you know, having Chance here, um, you know, JT being here, you know, Kareem getting hurt um, the early part of the summer um, probably expedited us, you know, looking for another quarterback, you know. So, you know, the thing is, you know, to, to battle it out during fall camp to see, uh, you know, who the guys are going to be. You know, Tyler came out of the spring as, as, uh, as the guy. Um, you know, who can come in and, and be that backup. And, you know, as you go through this league and the schedule that we have, you got to have at least two prepared to play. And so, you know, we're excited about what we saw in the spring and, and this summer and, you know, see how it plays out in fall camp. And so, obviously, with your quarterbacks, you have your primary targets. And then you don't have one of the targets from last year in Javon. So what are those expectations now? Like, have is Zach Patterson kind of, like, becoming that guy? Um, are there a few more that have been stepping up since you have a lot of, of new guys? Well, I think, you know, going into it, the expectations, you know, have really haven't changed. Um, you know, the year Zach had last year, I mean, he was the guy. I mean, you look at 80, 90 catches, newcomer of the year in the conference. And, you know, and, and the thing that I, when I talk about Zach, it's, you know, everybody looks at what he did last year. I look at what he's done since the end of the year. That's what people don't see. He has worked his tail off in the spring and this summer. And, you know, he, he's been the leader of that group. He may not be the vocal leader of that group, but he's the leader by example. And, and, and not only the receiver group, but the team, you know, they see it in him because he comes to work every day. It's, it's going to be fun to watch that group step up, hardworking group. Uh, Coach Lowe's done a great job with them. And it's going to be fun to see how it plays out, who the guys are going to be. You know, we, we know what Zach can do. Um, you know, guys like Jaheim and Stanley King who have played here, but, you know, it's the other guys, you know, whether they didn't get the opportunity last year or they're new, to see what they can do. Now the Demons won't have to use their flight reward points this season as they won't travel outside of Texas and Louisiana. And as she was looking to snap an 11-game non-conference losing streak dating back to 2018, they will face UL, LA Tech, Stephen F. Austin, and Eastern Illinois this year in non-conference play.